just marks. Why? Just why? Why do you do stuff like this to us? In this video, we're talking about the 980 Super Bowl, the fifth Super Bowl tailpiece for Trilogy and also Mark's Locks. The other day, I had a gentleman come in with one of the Mark's Survivor Grade 1. We don't sell those too often. We really only sell those to like institutions that have a need where if a Grade 1 or a Grade 2 regular LSDA won't work, we'll sell them that because it's pretty dang hefty, decent lever handle, I gotta admit. However, those lever handles and trilogies, which I'll put a picture up here in case you're not aware of it, trilogies use special tail pieces. Now that is not unheard of, you know, everybody makes kind of their own thing to work with their cylinders. For instance, uh, who am I thinking of? Hey girl, or not hey, yeah, well, uh, I think hey girl. Somebody has their own little cam for mortise cylinders. In that case, you have to have that special cam. In this case, to switch out a key and knob lever handle uh, cylinder, you have to have, on a trilogy, you have to have this 9HW580 ASSE. The first time this thing came in, it has three little parts in it, all right? Three little parts. It's got the disc, which the disc is usually already in the trilogy locks. It's got a tailpiece for screw cap style, and then it's got a clip style tailpiece, which is not really necessary. So understandably, now I guess they come just W580. This is through a different manufacturer, so I don't know if they just, I don't know what's going on, but this is what I got this time. I ordered two, and, uh, and they are uh, just that. They don't come with all these other ones, which, which really makes sense because you don't need the clip because most of the time what you're doing is you're taking off a cylinder like this one up here. This came out of that survivor lock, right? So this is the Marks cylinder that came out of the lock and it's got that same clip tailpiece. So it's pointless to send the tailpiece because almost always the reason you would need that tailpiece, number one, is because it's so wide. See how wide it is? We're gonna compare it to other tailpieces that come with key and knob cylinders. So yes, the lever handle can switch out perfectly fine. The, the, the cylinder, you can switch it to whatever key way you want, but cylinders don't come like this clip. They come with the screw cap and you can't take this and put in a screw cap. So if you're planning on doing that and you are not aware of the fact that you need the special tailpiece, you'll get on site and you'll be S-O-L. So, uh, the deal about them though, you might think, you know, no big deal. It's just, it's just a tailpiece. Just order, you know, a dozen of them and keep them on hand. The problem is, is they're so freaking expensive individually that it's ridiculous. In fact, if you see right here, we wrote on there, wrote on there, this is gonna be our retail price. Wait, 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 wait. where is it? Come on, come on. This is gonna be our retail price. $15, $15 for this little guy, simply because they are expensive and we're having to hold on to those cylinders, those tail pieces. We have to keep those around. That's one of those little parts that you have to keep around just in case. In my case, I need it for a cylinder that I'm going to switch out on a trilogy today. Hopefully I'll get a little bit of video on. And also the lever handles which again, this is out of one of their great one survivor lever handles, have also their own tailpiece, which is different than the Trilogy tailpiece. So either which way, if you do commercial work, it would behoove you to have to deal with stocking some expensive little tailpieces. Now these aren't as bad. We've got those marked $8, but the customer just gonna have to pay the price because of that. If they want the convenience of being able to use their master key with something that comes standard Schlage keyed and they need to buy a cylinder, you need to mark up the price on that. So uh, I have to go switch it out. I'm gonna kind of show you that well, we've already talked about it. That's it, that's the video. That's the video, they're expensive. 
W, if, if once again, TL, what is this, the TLDR? If you have a trilogy, Schlage keyway, not the removable core, but the standard Schlage keyways, you have to have the nine HW580 ASCII or just W580, which is the same price as that, should be cheaper because literally it's nothing but, nothing but a cam with special little ridges on the back. And then if you plan on working with, or if you ever see Mark's Survivor style locks, you need this special cam, which again is slightly different. Luckily, they're half the price, which is why we have half the retail price on there. But you have to have it. That's a little bit infuriating. Let me show you the regular tail pieces. Just as an example, but it's standard across everything. See how, see how, tail piece, regular screw cap style. Then we have the Mark's Survivor. See this, take cylinder out. It, it, it clips on. Look how narrow it is. If you try to use a cylinder with this, what happens is it's gonna wear where this grabs onto a lot quicker and or start slipping and mess up the lock uh, permanently. It, it would just make it go bad. So because they decided to use a super wide cam, you have to order the screw style because that clip style will not work. You take it off, it's it's not gonna it's not gonna work. Get a screwdriver here. And this is the exact same cylinder that is in trilogy. Oh come on off. What are you doing? Obviously these are kinda hard to get off too. Uh what are you doing? Come off. Thank you. So you can't take that. In some situations, you think you can just switch out the, the cam or the tailpiece, which we've done with deadbolt and other stuff, but that's not gonna work for a screw cap style. You have to have, you have, to have that for either lever or knob. So again, that's the video. Can't use existing if you have to work on a trilogy or if you have to work on a grade one survivor, March Brown lever handle, you would need the F or I'm sorry, 1903-C for trilogies. You would need the W580 or the longer version, 9HW580 ASCII. Ass is right. Rapid response, 319. Rapid response, 319.
So that's it. That's the video. Hopefully I got a little clip of me opening it and switching the cylinder out. I'm gonna go ahead and key up that cylinder. So all I have to do is travel up the elevator, quickly pick the lock, which hopefully I've already done and shown you, then switch the cylinder out and go collect. Thanks for watching y'all. Have a great one. If you have any questions or comments, as always, post them in the comment section. We'll catch y'all next video.